last night I delivered to this guy that we deliver we delivered to a lot, but he's an old drunk, and he's always an asshole on the phone. But he's really nice to the drivers and tips really well. He always orders twelve spicy wings, extra well done, blue cheese, and a meatball sandwich. Always. I take the delivery. He tips me like eight bucks on like an eighteen dollar order. Really nice, super drunk. I mean, the guy can't stand up without swerving. But you know, transaction went smooth. He tipped me well. You know, he's nice. I leave. I get back to the store and the manager's on the phone with him. And he's all bitching and cussing because his wings weren't well done and he got a ranch instead of a blue cheese. No complaints about the meatball sandwich, but the manager's like, this guy's an asshole. Because he, he complains a lot, but I feel like we fucking shit up, dude. You know, the ticket clearly said blue cheese. He clearly got a ranch. The ticket clearly said well done, extra well done. The wings clearly weren't. And so, Sure, he has the right to be upset, but the way he reacts was not acceptable. But he's drunk, not defending the guy. Drivers like him, insiders don't. So he demands his money back. The manager sends me back there to give him his money back. I get there, money in hand. He refused to take it. Or let me start let me start from the beginning. I pull up in the driveway and his food is all over the driveway. It's like he opened the door and just threw it out. And so I walk up to his porch, knock on the door. I was like, hey, you know, I apologize. Here's your money. I'll put a note in the computer so they We'll make sure they don't mess your order up next time. He's like, oh, I know, I know it's not your fault, man. It's not the little girl that answer the, answers the phones. It's not her fault. It's your fucking manager. He's a cocksucker. He can suck my dick. <laughs> I'm like, Jesus Christ, dude. Never heard you talk like this, ever. I'm just like, okay. He wouldn't take the money, and he said, if you want the food back, it's in my fucking driveway. And then he apologizes to me to, for talking to me that way. And then he started picking up all the food in the driveway to give it back to me. I was like, dude, I'm good. Just throw it away. Anyway, end of story. Well, the guy calls this morning. So this morning, he calls and asks for the manager, and the opening manager is our closing manager, the manager I talked to him last night, because for some stupid fucking reason, the general manager thinks it's, you know, cool to make somebody fucking close and then come back in and open. <laughs> Whatever. So... It's the same manager. I'm like, hey, uh, it's Mr. So-and-so. He's like, what the fuck? Are you serious? So he gets on the phone with him. He's talking to him. He's saying, yes, sir, I was your, I was the manager here last night. I, I know the situation. And he kept saying that over and over again. Because I guess the customer was telling him the story. And he goes... No, sir, that's not how it happened at all. No, no, sir. You were drunk, and you cussed us all out, and you told and you told my driver to tell me to suck your dick. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. So, when it comes down to it, you know, the customer got blacklisted, and we're no longer delivering to him. But if I ever answer the phone and it's him, I'm taking this fucking order. I want to get a body cam that way I can record these situations 
obviously I would blur out the customer's face, but we used to have this one customer. She lived in these apartments that aren't so great. And um, she was definitely a pillhead. And I would deliver it to her and she would literally fall asleep as she's signing the credit card slip. I was able to make a video of it. I mean, this was years ago. I, I don't know what happened to the video. I will try to dig it up. So I was able to find the video. It was recorded in November of 2013 with my Galaxy S3. That's why the quality kind of sucks and plus I had to stabilize it because it was real jerky. I don't know what the fuck I was doing, but here it is. Ma'am, are you okay? Ma'am? But it, it was fucking hilarious. She's sitting there signing the card and just nods off. And I'm like, ma'am? Ma'am? And I like kind of nudged the couch and shook it and she woke up and just continued on signing the card didn't say oh I'm sorry or whatever just <laughs> like it was normal you don't love me 